New album, True Blue, selling out and... This is how fans know Stevie Nicks, the ethereal gypsy of Fleetwood Mac, whose lilting voice is matched only by a haunting stage presence which has critics scrambling for superlatives. At the Crest Hotel today, things were much more down to earth. The flight from Sydney had left Stevie and her band a little weary, and the only clue to her mysterious image was to be found in background posters and her familiar black garb. A fact which some detractors have said points to an interest in black magic. Every, every single Halloween, I was with. <laughs> Because I just loved it, you know, I just wanted to be, you know, riding on a broom up in front of the moon, and that was, you know, and, and everybody got very, you know, carried away with this whole black magic witch thing. It's not, has nothing to do with me. Stevie says she's going through a rebuilding period at the moment. After the enormous success of Fleetwood Mac, a solo career is a whole different ball game. I realized that it was going to be, uh, I was going to have to work a little harder. Because, no, you know, it's like I kind of have this thing that I do and they don't, and since I've never played here, nobody really knows what that is, so I... Stevie and her band will perform at the Boondall Entertainment Centre tomorrow night. Lincoln Howes, Eyewitness News.